communities in Bayelsa states like Biseni, Barama, Ayakorama, and some other areas have already been sacked by the flood, while other communities are on the verge of suffering the same fate because access to such areas is becoming more difficult by the day. Senator Parker Emanuel speaks after a tour of affected communities in his senatorial districts. As you see by us, the entire state is flooded now. It's quite unfortunate, but this national disaster is not restricted to by us alone. And all what we can do is assist in whichever measure we can do to ameliorate the suffering of the people. As you can see, the whole house are flooded. People are sleeping on the road. No, heaven knows whether by next week the road will be overtaken by water. So I sympathize with the entire situation. We must all agree that it's a natural disaster and uh, it's not man-made. So it's just for the people who are affected uh, to be calm. We are all uh, victims of this uh, unfortunate uh, disaster. At a time of great pain, evacuation seems to be the only option to avert casualties. At this point, there's no way somebody can stay inside there. The only option remaining for us is to see how we can evacuate them. That is the only possible way we can go for them. There are various kinds of suffering. Suffering from disease, suffering from homelessness. But according to her, the worst form of suffering is the feeling of being unwanted. Why we are here is to identify with them, to share in their pain, that's why we come to see them. It is not man -made. so anybody getting upset should not be done with understand it's out of frustration that's uh, uh, a bit upset. But we all sympathize and empathize with them. But every community is affected. And based on the meteorological reports, by the end of this uh, month, we're expecting that the flood will see. Bayalsa is already tapped a grade A flood disaster states in Nigeria.